Alrighty, everybody, and yo! What is going on, everybody? It's Super Mario Nick without the K here on YouTube. And today, in this video, I'm going to be going over and basically ranking every single SML character based off of how cool they are. Now, look, cool is a very broad term, and it's a... Uh, it's a term that I guess a lot of people don't want to use, but today we're going to bring it back and we're going to use it. Now, these are the tiers that we're going to be going over. Here are some of the characters, and we are going to be basically going over a majority of the characters. Now, I will say, disclaimer, Roy is not on this list, and Roy would definitely be in swagger. Hell, he'd even have his own tier. That's how cool that guy is. But yeah, if you guys are going to go on to enjoy, please drop a like on the video, subscribe to the channel. Comment down below what tier list you want to see me do next, like in terms of what characters you want me to rank them by. And without further ado, guys, let's get right on to it. So here are the tiers. We have the swagger tier. That's just, you know, the top of the top, kind of like swag central. We got the cool tier. You know, you're cool. You're cool. The, the kind of cool tier. You're kind of cool. You know, you're sometimes cool. You know, you're cool. Uh, the not lame but not cool tier is, you know, it's kind of like, I mean, it is what it means, you know. Uh, kind of lame tier, I mean, you're kind of lame, you're lame in this tier, if you're in this tier, you're beyond lame, and then if you're, ima if you're in this tier, imagine being so lame that you're in this tier, LMAO, yeah, boys, that's what's up in today's video, so without further ado, I mean, if you get placed in this tier, that's just a laughing, it's a laughing joke, and, uh, you're just a joke, and without further ado, let's get right on to it, so, we're gonna start with the alien, as we always do, uh, honestly, I mean, aliens are kind of cool. This is the first time I'm going to give aliens some credit. I mean, the alien, like, isn't very cool because, like, you know, they kind of spit goo and stuff. But, you know, I mean, it's it's kind of cool because it's different. You know what? I'll take it. It's fine. We got Atso. First time I'm not calling Atso Hansel by mistake. Atso, Atso's not lame, but he's not cool. You know, like, I, I wouldn't, I, he's kind of funny, so I guess he's not that lame, but he's also not cool either. Um, definitely not cool. Black Yoshi, Black Yoshi's cool, he, he's swag, I mean, he got it on, you know, like, he, he's good, I mean, my boy's good, I mean, yeah, I mean, the dude literally lives rent-free, like, literally rent-free, I mean, how can you not think that's cool, man? You live rent-free, you do whatever you want in your life. You play Call of Duty 24-7. I mean, that's just a vibe, man. That's literally a vibe. Junior. Uh, Junior. Now, look. In the latest video... Okay, you know what? Junior's always been portrayed as a lame character. Like, he's always been like, oh... Junior doesn't have what Cody has. Junior doesn't have what Joseph has. He's lame. He needs the limited edition. I don't know. He needs the limited edition gold brick mine from Kentucky. I, I don't even know, dude. But all I'm trying to say is Junior usually is being portrayed as lame. And I think that in this case, I, I, I got to put him in lame. I got to put him in lame. You know what? Even Joseph called him lame. He is lame. I guess. Bowser. Bowser's kind of lame. He's not as lame as Junior, but yeah, he's pretty lame. All he does is watch Charlie and Friends, and that that's it. Like, that's his life. No, that is literally his life. He he, he threatened to, you know, um, to uh, use the rope when uh, Charlie and Friends got canceled. So that means it's literally his life. Um, beyond lame. I mean, <laughs> beyond lame, uh, Brooklyn T guy, Brooklyn T guy's a bit interesting, right? Because he can sometimes be like that cool doctor, you know, that's just kind of going around hanging out, or he can kind of be a little lame at times. He's not lame, but he's not cool. He, I think he's fine. Like he's fine. He, he's okay. He's average. Bully Bill, Bully Bill's kind of cool just because he's like the bully, but I mean, if Bully Bill were not all sm all talk and no smack, you know, like, if he was all bite and no bark, you know, that kind of thing, then he'd definitely be in, like, swagger or cool, but since the guy's literally all bark and no bite, he's kind of, he's just kind of cool. Uh, I do, how do I even rank her? I mean, I don't even know how I rank her. 
Die, I usually rank her, but I, I'm just going to put her not lame, not cool, because I don't know where to put her. Chef PP. Chef PP is a bit interesting, because I think he is kind of cool, but I also don't know. I think... But then again, he's also broke as a joke. Chef PP is kind of lame. No, he is lame. He, he's going with Junior. He's lame. All he does is cook for 45 cents a year, and then... Yeah, and then that's literally all he does. Cook for 45 cents a year, put hair in the food, and then gets like a five-hour sleep schedule. Not even, probably like two hours, who even knows. Doesn't even have his own house. Yeah, he's lame. Cody. Cody is... Cody, okay, Cody's kind of lame, and I'll explain why. Back in the no 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 he he that, no he's lame if, if he cannot be less lame than Junior and you know I was thinking like oh yeah now Cody's kind of seen as more cool than Junior like especially with a with a girl like Penelope like Cody's liked a lot more than Junior and like Cody's I guess more cool and more like you know attractive or whatever because he has like a six pack but the problem is is that um. We can't ignore the past. We actually cannot ignore the past. So I have to put him in lane. Craig. Craig is the definition of all bark and no bite. Like literally Craig. Uh, Craig Craig is like the nicest dude I've ever seen. But <laughs> Craig is like the nicest guy. Wholeheartedly Craig is the nicest guy I've ever seen. But he's also like he tries to be evil. He's one of those guys that tries to be evil. But in reality he's just such a nice dude deep down. So yeah he's lame. Chris the Cucumber, I mean, he's kind of lame, I, he's not cool, but he's not lame, I mean, the, his his facts are very much incorrect, so I guess that's kind of lame, but I think he's okay, Doofy, Doofy, Doofy's cool, man, Do, Doofy's cool, I like that guy, man, I like him, you know, um, I mean, he kind of knows what's up, I mean, he, he he's basically the inventor of dumb ways to die, that kind of thing, but the Doofy, I like him. He's he's cool. He's not quite swagger, but I think he's cool for sure. Um, uh, Phoebe, beyond lame. Like, beyond lame. I might even put her in this tier. But, yeah, she is absolutely lame. Beyond lame. Um, she's also very dead. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm not going to make that joke again. I do apologize. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, there's a video... Uh, Jeffy's sister returns, Phoebe dies there, but, uh, yeah, it's at the end of the video, I'm, I'm sorry, I had to make that joke, it was right there, I had to, um, Paul, Paul does not have any arms, he's lame, um, if you're watching this video and you don't have any arms, don't worry, this is just for entertainment purposes, I know how hard it is to deal with disabilities, like, oh, well, I don't know, but, like, you know, I can only imagine, um, Gumbo, Gumbo is so lame that, Imagine being so lame that you're in this tier, LMAO. Yeah, Gumbo, get in here. You're absolutely lame. Hansel, beyond lame. I mean, he, he's a homeless man. He's, he's just Chef PP, but doesn't have a job. And that's basically Hansel. Mario's grandpa. Mario's grandpa is swagger. And, okay. Okay, no, 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 no. He, he's kind of cool. You know, he's kind of cool. I mean, he, he does everything grandpa style. You know, what's up? Like, he, he makes those references to world wars and stuff. Like, he knows what's going on. He has a history, you know. I think he can probably, you know, outsmart anyone when it comes to history of the United States. I mean, he got this. I mean, he's kind of cool. You got to admit, he's a pretty cool grandpa. Like, he'd be someone that you'd actually want to take care of kind of thing. I, I don't know. Maybe that's just me. No, I'm just going to put him in not lame but not cool. Ah, who am I kidding? He's not cool. Um, all right. Jackie Chu. Jackie Chu is kind of cool because I'll tell you what. He is actually a pretty sick teacher. I'm not going to lie. If I had Jackie Chu, I'd have a lot of fun. He is kind of cool to me. I think he's pretty sick. I mean, there's no reason for me not to put him here. I think he's definitely... Definitely deserving of this spot. Jimmy Chu. I mean, he's incredibly unsuccessful. He's incredibly lame and incredibly stupid. So I guess that's kind of where he goes. But I love him. I love him. I absolutely love him. Jacques, Jacques is cool. Like, no, Jacques is swagger, man. Jacques is the first swagger of the video. Now, the reason Jacques is swagger, he's, he's not your typical, like, you know, 
um, in person when you think of swagger, but you got to think about it. My man, literally, this dude is a French guy. You know, he's got like probably the most dope mustache I've ever seen in my entire life. The curl is beyond perfect. And this dude paints for $50 million a piece. And this dude literally killed himself for a painting. If that's not swag, I don't know what is. This has to be the coolest SML character I have ever seen. But let's see if anyone else is there. Jamal, I mean, Jamal, Jamal kind of acts like he's cool. I don't know if he is cool, but he acts like he's cool, I guess. Like, he just doesn't give a shit about anybody. So, you know, I'm just going just gonna to put him in cool and call it a day, I guess. Jeffy's kid, you know, no, he's kind of cool. He, it's no, he, he's not that cool. He's kind of cool. Jeffy's kid. Now, this is an interesting one because he's going in this tier. He's so lame that he actually is in this tier. Imagine Jeffy. Jeffy's. Mm, I mean, Jeffy can really knock someone out in a fight. Like Jeffy could really do that. But. He also has a pencil and a and up his nose and a diaper outside of his pants. So I'm going to put him in lame. Um, Joseph's mom is lame. And I'll tell you why. Like, who abandons their child, man? That's just lame. Who abandons their child because they won the lottery? Like, come on, man. That's, that's, that's so... That's, that's beyond lame. Nah, get that in there. Um, I know that she gives money to Joseph in Joseph the Millionaire, but that that technically was supposed to be erased from our entire memory, so I'm not going to include that. Um, then we got Joseph. Joseph is Joseph was always cooler than Junior, but like not not anymore. But like just because of that narrative, I'm going to put him above these two. He's he's kind of lame still, but he's not he's not like as lame as these two. Um. See, because if you're talking about old SML, Joseph's kind of cool. If you're talking about new SML, he's lame. So I kind of have to put him here. You know, Junior is beyond lame, but becomes lame because he was kind of lame before. Cody used to be, imagine being in this tier, that's how lame you are, to like, you know, now being kind of cool. So I'm going to put him somewhere in like here, you know? So I guess that's kind of fair. Uh, Judy, Judy's beyond lame, but it's funny how lame she is. Um... Ken, Ken is a bit of a different story though, because Ken is swagger. No, I'm joking. Uh, Ken, I don't know where to put Ken. I have absolutely no idea, and I think there's a reason for that. He does not have many, uh, many voice lines. Let's just say that. Lone Dolphin, my man, Lone Dolphin. Uh, Lone Dolphin's pretty cool. I mean, the dude wears a black leather jacket, which is obviously, he already gets 10 points for that. Um, he's a dolphin that's on land, another 10 points for that. And he's just overall, like, he's super cool. Like, imagine getting your debt collected by a lone dolphin. Like, that's pretty cool. Luigi, uh, this looks like Luigi, not Mama Luigi. So I'm going to assume this is Luigi. Luigi's lame. Mama Luigi would probably be kind of lame or not lame, but not cool. So I guess I'm going to do that. Mario's grand or Bowser's grandma, I meant to say, is beyond lame. Absolutely atrocious. Um, Mario, Mario's lame. Let's be, let's be honest. Mario's lame. I mean, he's a dude that can't even afford to pay his house payments. Uh, I don't even know what he does for a living anymore because apparently he got kicked out of Nintendo. I don't know what he does. I don't know how he gets money. He's like your typical father. I, I, I don't know. I don't know. Mr. Goodman. Mr. Goodman is swagger. This dude, does that. he has no chill when he comes to get your house payment. Absolutely no chill. And then on top of that, not only does he have no chill, but he also... Literally, like, he does not care if you have your house payment or not. He's going to get it from you somewhere or another. He's going to find a way to pull money out of your butt and make it magically come to him. I don't know how that works, but we'll just say that's how it works. And, uh, yeah, he's just super swagger. He's super rich, and I think that makes sense. David Winkle, my man, my G, he's swag. Okay, no, 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 no. Okay, if I put David Winkle and swagger, um, there would be some issues with me mentally. Uh, and I'd have to go check that out. But 
Uh, for what he's for what he does, I mean, it's beyond lame what he does. Like actually, uh, if you guys don't know the story of David Winkle, I highly suggest you watch First Grade. I don't want to get demonetized, so I don't want to talk about that story here because there will definitely be some things I have to talk about. Um, that I definitely don't want to put in the video. Jeffy's mom, imagine being so lame. Like, imagine being in jail. Imagine beating your kid and going to jail for it. Imagine spitting on a guy, even though he said not to do it, and charging him for it, getting arrested for it. Imagine doing all that in just, like, one episode. And that'd be pretty funny. Yeah, that'd be pretty lame, too. It would also be very funny, but also very lame. Patrick... Patrick is crazy. I mean, I like the dude. I like the dude. He's not lame, but he's not cool, you know? If you think what he does is lame, that's totally acceptable. If you think he's swagger, then that's totally acceptable. I just decided to put him in the middle. Peach. Peach is a different story. Again, Peach has just always been lame, beyond lame. Uh, let's put Rosalina in there. She is stupidly lame. It's not even funny. I might actually put her in here. Like, okay, no. She's, she's the definition of lame. Like, imagine... Not letting anybody do in the house anything that she wants. Like, she's so lame. She always bails out Jeffy from every situation. Always takes Jeffy's side. Incredibly lame character. Pixie Goblin's kind of cool. And if Tanner were here, he'd also be kind of cool as well. But, I mean, Pixie Goblin's badass, you know? Like, he, he pulled a fire drill in the middle of school. He pulled a fire alarm. And uh, they had to do an emergency evacuation during a test. So that's pretty cool. I wish someone would do that for me during my physics test, but you know, we can't all have what we want. I hope I wish there was a pixie goblin in my class though. I really do wish that. Um then we got Richard. Richard is He's only cool because he has money. But I'm not gonna put him in cool. He's kinda cool. He's only cool because he has money. His personality is kinda lame. We're gonna put him in kinda cool. Scooter. Scooter is beyond lame. It's actually not even funny. I don't think he's quite as lame as these guys, but he is pretty lame. I'm not even gonna lie. Uh, Screwball. Screwball's cool. Like, he's literally like the ideal birthday clown that you'd wanna have at your party. No, no, no. Screwball's cool, man. He, he's a, he's a criminal clown at children's parties. Like, he's awesome. Like, the man is awesome. I don't know what else to say. Shrek. Shrek is kind of lame. I mean, all he does is eat cheesecake and go to the bathroom. Yeah. Imagine that being your life. Wake up, eat cheesecake, uh, have a bathroom schedule, eat more cheesecake, have another bathroom schedule, go to sleep, wake up the next morning, eat cheesecake, have another bathroom schedule, eat more cheesecake, have another bathroom schedule, and go back to sleep, wake up again. It's a rinse and repeat situation, and I don't, I don't know. Uh, so that, so that's actually cool. Like, Honestly, like, especially in the first grade series, man, like, she knew how to rock it, man. Like, she, she knew how to do it. Like, she was just, like, that, that smart girl from Brooklyn got Toad an A on her, on his test. And let's put Toad in the cool tier as well. Lil T, my guy, he's gonna be in the cool tier as well. Another cool, cool character that I'm definitely gonna put there. Um, Toad's cool. Toad's always been cool. In fact, I mean, his music's so cool. He might even be to Toad Swagger. Toad Swagger. I'm sorry. Toad is Swagger. Toad is absolutely Swagger. When you think of Swag, you think of Toad. And uh, and I think of J Roy and Jacques Pierre Francois, but that's my opinion. Tony's, Tony's lame. Not even going to lie. The chicken. It's a chicken. I don't know where to put that. No. I'm just going to put it in lame. Tyrone. Tyrone's cool. Tyrone, Tyrone got it. I mean... You know, uh, he, he went to Sacramento State Prison for college. I mean, he, you know he's cool. Like, he, he even said that he went to Sacramento State Prison for college. Um, and I think that's pretty cool. But, uh, yeah, I mean, I wish I could go to Sacramento. Okay, no, I don't wish that. <laughs> I'm not. No, 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 no. Yeah, I take back everything I was about to say there. Uh, these two are both. They're the Lane brothers. I mean, and then we have Woody. Woody is not lame, but not cool, in my opinion. So, yeah, that is going to be me for the video. I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, I mean, comment down below, of course, what you would change. But if you did enjoy, please drop a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, and I'll catch you all in the next one.